Welcome to a Breathe With Me in a Pep Talk. You've probably noticed over the last couple weeks that these are getting combined together just because of the busyness of my schedule right now. So when I think about doing a Breathe With Me episode, I also think about making it the pep talk and how to best inspire you and inspire me so we can show up and enjoy our everyday life. Now, today's big pep talk idea is about the idea of love. Every day, you probably write a to-do list or you have one running in your head a to-do list of all of the things that you have to do and probably quite a few things that you don't really have to do, but your brain is overthinking it all. Probably some things that you could delegate to some other people. But for now, I want you to think about this. I want you to think that love is the why of life. Every day, love is the why Love is why we're doing these things. Why am I making dinner? Yes, it's because I have to eat. But why am I making this dinner? Well, it's because I love my family and I want to have that community time together. Love is the ultimate why. Now, efficiency is the how we love. Efficiency is the how behind what we love. And efficiency isn't for tasks for me. Efficiency is how are the people around me receiving my love? If love is the ultimate why, then how efficient am I at making those other people feel loved? How is my love getting across? When I look at my to-do list that way, The amount of stuff that gets done isn't as important. Okay, now let's do some breathing and reset our day together. Because I don't know about you, but I still find after all these weeks of practicing this in 2020, when I confuse the why of my days with getting stuff done instead of being love. If I confuse the why of my days with being productive instead of loving well, then I notice I start holding my breath. So let's sit down or stand up, relax those shoulders, make sure your ears and shoulders aren't touching. (sighs) Unclench your jaw, soften your forehead. Okay, now rub your hands together. Put your hands on your heart. Do you feel the heat from your hands rubbing together? Love is the why. Let's take a big breath in and hold it. Exhale. Hold. Inhale. Hold, exhale, hold, inhale, exhale, hold. Okay, now go back to normal breathing. Love is the why. And with each breath, I remember that love is the why. And with each breath, I pull a memory. A memory that reminds me how powerful love is, a memory that has my body relax and fill completely with love and acceptance and kindness. (sighs) 
Maybe your memory has a sound playing in your head, or you remember a smell, or you're seeing a picture in your head, whatever it is, just let your body remember that love is the why. Your heart and your brain will show you lots of evidence of this when we pause. Love is the why. Okay, let's rub our hands together again to get them nice and warm. As you're just breathing naturally. Okay, do you feel the heat in your hands? I want you to put your hands on your heart again. I love myself. Love is the why. Thank you for being here in this moment with me. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for sharing this podcast and writing a rating and review. But most of all, thank you for helping be the change that we all want in this world by remembering why we're here and that we're not supposed to do this alone. You are the right mom for your kids and your kids are the right kids for you. We are truly better together. Thank you. And I'll see you next time. This is Christy Thomas. Don't forget to go check out www.keepcalmmotheron.com.